I hope everybody's having a fantastic day. Now, remember, I placed in that post for you guys last week that we have a bride is getting married in September on the 22nd of this year. Now, I am going to need a tremendous lot of help from you guys because the challenge comes in right here now we're only working with this much space and it's going to hold between anywhere to 50 to 75 people now the max that my husband and i have done with our company cb interior event decoration has been 400 plus people so i asked you guys to come along for the journey you said yes and so i'm so super excited to share this series with you guys so today we're focusing on finding lanterns and things for her wedding so stay tuned because this is going Going to be an amazing journey and i don't know if you remember like some people that when i was on snapchat now i said was i'm no longer on snapchat when they was building this area jamie i know if you're watching you remember because you was commenting on it in on snapchat so they finally got it open girl they got the hobby lobby there it stays busy out here home goods i'm totally short so i had to stand up <laughs> ultra beauty I mean, five and below. I've never been in five and below, you guys. And I've never been in Ultra Beauty either. And then they got a Kirkland's coming. They have some, like still have some empty buildings. Like that building there. And that building over there. So large building is totally empty, y'all. But we're going to be starting right here. Hobby Lobby. And then we're going right here to Home Goods. We... And then TJ Maxx, which is in the other shop, shopping center, not even a mile from here, and Michael's. So let's go over there. These are some very beautiful, tall lanterns. These are very gorgeous. This one right here is the one I'm looking at. However, it's not promotional week. This is beautiful. And this one is gorgeous as well. This is beautiful. I know the other one was like $69 and this one is $139.99 so but I'm looking at that one and of course I will continue to look at some more lanterns somewhat else it's cute as well that's $24.99 however I think Michaels have a, a larger one we have some in stock but I think we may go with white. I think we're gonna go with that. See like these here? This is gorgeous. So I think they're gonna be on sale next week. So what you guys think? The, like the white one would be beautiful and I would insert like the her color scheme. Now I found these flowers. These are it matches exactly the bouquet. You see that? Perfectly. That is so perfect. Now, remember she has that eggplant color. So, this is what we're going to be going with. It's going to be very beautiful. So, I'm just going to have to just pretty much bring... All, she want her... This is going to be her more dominant color and then the mint and then the ivory are her accent pieces that's what she wants so we have to give our client what they desire so now i'm gonna get ready and just do some more looking around but i want to pick up these because i want to have just a few more to go so let me do some more looking around and i think i'm done i think i'm pretty much done with that right there so yeah and this is just pretty much giving you an idea but this is not how it's going to look. But this is just pretty much giving you an idea. Because all this greenery right here will have to be gone. That's too much. Too much greenery. It's too much. So, yes. So now I'm just going to determine how much I need. And how much I need to put back. And that's all I'm going to do is just balance it out. And just keep watching the vlogs to see how everything comes together.
Now these are the ones they have at Michaels. Now I don't know if it's 40% weak or 50%. The only thing is it doesn't come with the LED light in there. So about time you get through paying for it. I don't know what I'd be better off with the ones over there at Hobby Lobby or what. So you guys let me know down below what you think about the lanterns. We have time. Because you guys will be getting this video quite soon. And remember, I got this one for like cheap. I think I got it for $8 because it was damaged. That's nice. It's just not in the right colors. Okay, friends. That is going to do it for today. Now, I didn't end up going to Home Goods, but that's okay because we will be going there in just a little bit. Now, I want to remind you, this was already booked. This place was already booked before I became her wedding event planner and also decorator and coordinator for her wedding day. Now, the challenge is she won a dance floor and she also won a buffet area in this same location right here in this area. So that's what the challenge is right there. It can only really hold between anywhere to 25 to 50 people. But with God, all things are possible, everyone. So the people at the location were working together to make sure that this happens for our bride. So tag along with us for this journey. Be inspired and motivated that you can do it. Blessings, everyone.